Hello everyone. I am Sonali Kanavde, Assistant Professor of AIDS Department in All India Shishivaji Memorial Society's Information Technology Pune. In this video, we are going to uh, discuss about the decision control statements in Python. So, uh, first is the decision control statement. Uh, then uh, there are three types. Selection or conditional branching statement in that we are going to uh, see in the uh, if, if else, nested if, if, if else, then basic loop structure, iterative statement, while loop, for loop, selecting appropriate loop, nested loop, the break, continue, pass, else statement used with the loops. So decision control structure. First of all, a statement or a set of statement that is executed when a particular condition is true and ignored when the condition is false. It's called decision control structures. The decision to execute a particular um, section is based on checking condition. In the, uh, in the case of decision control statement in C language, nested if and if else, a group of available statement will get executed in case the conditions we have are true. The execution of the else part statement won't occur whenever these available conditions happen to be false. Decision control statement is a statement that determines the control flow of a set of instructions means DCS decides the sequence in which instruction in the program is to be executed. So there are uh, fundamental method of uh, control flow in programming language are sequential control, selection or conditional control, and next is the iterative control or basic loop uh, structure. So sequential control, when the program is executed line by line means from the first line to the second line, uh, then uh, from the second line to the third line and so on. This method is also called as sequential control, that is the line by line. Uh, then next is the selection or conditional branching statement. When we execute only a selected set of statement, then we use the selection control statement. It usually jumps from one part of the code to another, depending on whether a particular condition is satisfied or not. Then uh, in selection control statement, we learn about if else, if statement, if else statement, and if else. Uh, elif else statement. If statement it is the simplest form of decision control statement that is frequently used in decision making. If a conditional statement used for decision making operation, in other words, it enables the programmer to run a specific code only when a certain condition is made. The body of Python's uh, if statement begins with indentation. The first under uh, an indented line mark marks the end. Remember that non zero value are interpreted by Python as a true file, none and zero are false. So, this is the example. Next is the how if statement work in Python. First, the program evaluates the text expression. If uh, it is true, the statement will execute it. If it is false, the statement will not be executed. The following flowchart demonstrates how an if statement works in Python. So first, if condition is true, then uh, the program will be executed. It will be uh, if uh, the condition is false, the statement will not be executed. So next is the if else statement. Uh, if else statement adds onto the function if uh, of an if statement instead of simply a refraining uh, refraining from executing statement when the test expression is false it provides alternative instruction for the program to follow you will use indentation to separate the if and else block of the code in that here we put the example the next is uh, how if else statement works. The program evaluates the test expression. If it is true, the statement 
will be executed. If it is false, then uh, it, the alternative option will be given. Uh, then the following flowchart demonstrates the how if else statement works in Python. Then uh, how to use an if else statement in Python. If you need a program to execute certain function under specific condition, you should use an if else statement. Conditional statement like if else are also known as conditional flow statement. Okay. Then next is what is elif in Python. Elif is the shortest version of else is. It enables you to perform a series of checks to evaluate the condition of multiple expression. For example, suppose the first statement is false, but you want to check for another condition before executing the list one. In that case, uh, you can use the uh, else or any to look for the other specified condition before Python decide which action will take. Uh, you can have to any number of any statement for an uh, and if statement. This is the example. Then this is how to uh, if elif else uh, works in Python. The interpreter will evaluate multiple expression one at a time, starting with the if statement. Once an expression is evaluated as a true, that blocks of code will execute. If no expression is true, the else statement will execute. The following flowchart demonstrates how an if else if elif else statement works in Python. The next is nested if else statement. In programming, nested, nesting is a term that describes placing one programming construct inside another. Suppose you have more than two options to handle in your code. In that case, you can use a nested if else statement to check condition. In consecutive order, once a condition succeeds, it will move on to the next block in the uh, event that none of the condition article else clause will take effect. This is the example how to uh, how to work the nested if else statement in Python. Thank you.